Hello, it's Dr. Joseph Aiello from San Diego Center for Integrative Medicine, and today I want to point out that we have posted on our Facebook page and Google Plus and Twitter a very important article that I would like everybody to see. This article talks about how nutrition has been helpful in preventing and helping to treat cancer. This article talks about a ketogenic diet, which is basically a low-carb diet, and it shows that there has been some evidence now that demonstrates that having a low-carb uh, diet and a ketogenic diet is beneficial in helping to prevent cancer, and also when patients are undergoing cancer treatment, it helps to enhance the treatment and actually helps the patient to improve. The article is very important. I think it highlights the fact that since the 1970s when we tried to go onto a quote low fat environment, the food companies then enhanced all the foods with a lot of carbohydrates. And when this happened, we started seeing a, a large influx of diabetes and overweight and a lot of different syndromes and problems occurring, like metabolic syndrome. Well, what happened is when people undergo a very high carb diet, they end up increasing their insulin levels to very high levels, which the body is not used to because the body wants to try to lower the sugar in the blood, so therefore it ramps up the insulin considerably higher. And insulin is a growth hormone. So insulin is critical to all cancer cells as far as helping them to grow and keeping them growing. So the whole idea behind a ketogenic or a low-carb diet is the fact that you completely clamp down on the insulin levels when you're on a low-carb diet, and this therefore starves the, the cancer cells from their ability to grow. And what this does, is it helps then the immune system, which is doing surveillance and, and killing off the cancer cells all the time, it helps it to do its job because the cancer cells are not rampantly growing. And it also relieves the immune systems of all the inflammation that's going on with all the extra carbs and the wheat and everything else that people are eating. So it's a combination of helping boost the immune system and then starving the cancer cells of the nutrition that they need, which then helps the body to get rid of these rampant cells. So I hope that you read the article and can fully understand what the importance of this is, and I'm sure in the future we'll start to see more things like this. So thank you very much. This is Dr. Ayala.